in the neighborhood this morning. Many, many unhappy, bewildered breakfast faces. I guess it's best not to think of the victims, right? Yeah, you don't even entertain that. Is that the right psychology? What? Is that the correct criminal psychology, not to think of the victims? Oh, victims. What? The victims of crime! Breaking and entering, boy! This is a prerequisite for a criminal not to have a conscience act to criminal. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> Yo, hey, oh, 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 let's get, go, oh, oh, hey, whoa, 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 goodbye! Yo, yo, oh, yo, okay, good boy, go, oh, come on, what? through the fire, oh, 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 now what are you going to do with all those toasters? That is the dumbest thing that I ever saw in my life. I've got hundreds of dollars of household appliances here, boy. Oh, 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 you may not realize Yeah, that. and how many hundreds of dollars did you walk right past? It was toasters you challenged me to. Only I toasters. I, I ignored every other temptation. That's no challenge. Anybody can get out and steal some toasters. You don't have to take it out of my typewriter. The machine's fault that you can't write. It is a sin to do that to a good machine. A sin? Yeah. You consider all the writers that never even had a machine who would have given an eyeball for a good typewriter. Any typewriter. All those writers who wrote on paper bags and matchbook covers. Toilet paper. And their writing destroyed by their jailers who persisted beyond all odds. Those writers would find it hard to understand your actions. Not to mention demolishing a perfectly good golf club. What about all the struggling golfers? <laughs> what about Lee Trevino? No. Now, what do you think that Lee would have said? He was out there batting balls around with broomsticks at the age of nine, impoverished. Oh! <laughs> Get the big fella here. What? what the hell time is it? Hey, I got no idea, boy. Time stands still when you're having fun. Well, is it too late to call a woman? You know any women? Hey, I'm a married man. Austin, I mean a local woman. Hey, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> mm. It is too late or too early. Hey, you're the nature enthusiast, aren't you? Huh? Can't you tell the time by the the light in the sky? Yeah, go on, get out there. Come on, orient yourself around the North Star or something. What? Oh, I can't tell anything. You, you go on, you get out. Oh, oh maybe you need a little breakfast. <laughs> Austin, I don't need some toast. I need a woman. Oh, hey, a woman isn't the answer. It, it never was. I am not talking about permanent. I am talking about temporary. No, no, no. We are just going to test the merits of these little demons. We're going to see which brands have that tendency to burn. And then we'll see which ones can produce a perfectly golden piece of fluffy toast. How much gas you got in your car? Well, you know, I haven't driven my car for days now, so uh, um, I just haven't had the opportunity to look at the gas gauge. Then today. take a guess. Do you think there's enough gas to get me to Bakersfield? 
Bakersfield. <laughs> what's in Bakersfield? Austin, never mind what's in Bakersfield. Do you think there is enough goddamn gas in your car? Sure! <laughs> yeah, you could care less, right? Just let me run out of gas on the grapevine. You could give a shit. Hey, I'd say there's enough gas to get you just about anywhere, Lee. With your determination and guts. <laughs> what the hell time is it anyway? Hey, it's very early. It's the time of the morning when the coyotes kill people's Yaka Spaniels. You hear them out there? That's what they're doing out there. Luring innocent pets away from their homes. Who? What's that, what's that area code for Bakersfield, you know? Call the operator. I can't stand that voice they give you. What voice? That voice that warns you... If you'd only tried harder to find that number in the phone book, you would never even have to be calling us operators to begin with. Hey, I don't know why you want to talk to anyone else anyway. Come on, talk to me! I'm your brother! I want to talk to a woman, homo, okay? I haven't heard a woman's voice in a long time. Oh, not since you're botanist? What? Oh, nothing. Red sails. Boy, out on the blue. He's carrying my love one. Home safely to me. Fred sailing the sun dead. Way out on the blue. <laughs> He's carrying my love one. Austin, knock it off, will ya? It's long distance here. Bakersfield? Yeah, Bakersfield. It's in Kern County. What county are we in? Hey, you better get yourself a 7 up, boy. Operator, hello. Go on! Operator. Hey, one county is as good as another. Yeah, boy. operator. Yeah. Yes. First off, I want to know that area code for Bakersfield. Bakersfield, huh? sir? Bakersfield? Yeah, that's right. Bakersfield. All right. All right, that is in our county. I can help you on that. Okay, good. All right, what can I do for you, sir? Now, I wonder if you can help me track somebody down. Well, you need huh? an address, sir? Take no, I don't, address. operator. I mean a phone number. All right. Just a phone number, okay? All right, sir. Okay. All right, sir. What is the name? Okay. What is the name, sir? The name is Melly Ferguson. What? Huh? What? Melly. Melly? Melly? I don't know, maybe. What's her name? Uh, maybe Melanie. Melanie. All right. Operator, okay. Okay. Melanie Ferguson. Melanie Ferguson. Sir, you're going to have to speak up. I can't hear you. What? I can't hear you, sir. Uh Speak more clearly. Well, I can't hear you so good. It sounds like you're under the ocean. All right, sir. I'll check on the name. Hold on one second. Ferguson. Ferguson. Melanie Ferguson. I have 10 listings for Melanie Ferguson in Bakersfield. You've got 10 Melanie Ferguson? Yes, sir, I have 10 Melanie Ferguson. Now, how can that be? I don't know, sir. I don't like the book. Now, you are going to sit there and tell me you've got 10 Melanie Melanie Ferguson's just in Bakersfield? You have an address, sir. Well, just give me all 10 of them, then. Operator, now, don't go weird on me. Just give me all 10 of them, then. Okay? Okay, hang on one second. Uh, Get me a pen, boy. Come on, pen, pen. I don't have a pen. Then get me a pencil, then. Come on. I don't have a pencil. (laughs) You're a writer, and you don't have a pen or a pencil. Hey, I'm not the writer, boy. You're the writer. Austin, I am on the phone here. Now get me a pen or pencil. I gotta watch the toast. Hang on a second, operator.